hello and welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna be doing a weekend in my life productive I, i'd say it's gonna be a pretty productive weekend i've already done some productive things today but right now i need to go or i don't need to go but i'm gonna go to a cafe to edit my video to get it up soon it's beautiful out right now it's like 11 degrees the sun is out i'm wearing like a little red summer tank top and a light jacket like this is the tiniest little jacket let's go to your cafe get some good coffee and get some work done So I just got out of the cafe and then I went to Paige's, that's a bookstore, and they had the cat. I have never seen this cat before. I've been there a few times. Now I'm just sitting like at a random spot near the river. Okay, so I just came back to sit by the river and literally everyone is out running and walking by the river. This is my view right now. The city's beautiful in the sun. And it just made me think like how crazy it is that I live here. Because if you don't know, I grew up in a small town and I've always wanted to live in a big city, which this obviously is not a huge city, but it, yeah, it's a pretty big city and it's getting bigger. So I'm really grateful I finally get to live in a city. I want to live like dead center of the city one day, but I'm getting closer. So I sorry I'm getting really like sappy and cheesy about living in a city Ooh, i just feel like sometimes we don't stop and think about how far we've come you are always thinking about the next thing like what do i have to do next what do i have to achieve next and you just never tend to just sit and be like damn like look at all this stuff i've already done okay i just took the train back to my car i went inside this little store like this little grocery store that has like local i guess suppliers and i got these little olives They're kind of expensive but olives always kind of are but i kind of want to try one right now but i was just on the train i just put like, hand sanitizer on but i'm wondering if i can just like tip one into my mouth we'll see let's see look at them it's like a mixed type of olive i actually used to not like olives when i was younger and i also didn't like pickles and the older i've gotten the more i'm obsessed with them oh how do i do this I thought it was filled with like cheese or something, but that's good. Also, I went into this thrift store. It's actually like a consignment store, so you can sell stuff to it. And a lot of the stuff was like fairly expensive, but I get it. Like it's like curated stuff. Found this for $12, but it's Banana Republic and it's really good quality. She's gorgeous. It's like this long, really soft red top. <coughs> red top. Sorry, I almost just choked on my olive pieces but it's really good quality it feels so soft that's what i got and then now i'm about to head home and then i'm gonna eat dinner and probably edit the rest of my video anyways i'll see you at home or maybe i'll see you tomorrow depending on if i get up to anything tonight Okay, I just did my makeup. I forgot to film my breakfast, but I had breakfast and now it's literally like two o'clock now. I finished my class at 10.30, but I had breakfast and then I was working on some stuff for YouTube and then I had stuff to do for taxes. I just wanted to get it done. I was like, I don't want to procrastinate this. So I did some, I decided to do some productive things and now I just finished my makeup. This is your reminder 
to wash your makeup brushes like immediately after you do your makeup on like a weekend day so then they can be dry by the time you need to do your makeup the next day but yeah i'm gonna go wash my makeup brushes real quick and then i'm gonna do my hair and get dressed but yeah wash makeup brushes this is your reminder okay so i just got dressed this is kind of like a a comfy fit you can't really tell but this skirt has like an acid wash kind of vibe to it and then this is just a zara top i was filming something for a different video but i'm gonna make a little coffee a little french press now and me and my sister decided we're gonna go out for dinner tonight so i'm really excited because it's nice and sunny out we can wear like cool outfits i don't think this is gonna be my outfit but i'm excited to get dressed up go out on the town and just have good food but yeah, so I think it's 11 degrees out right now and just the summer energy is doing something doing something to my mood It's just I'm so excited for summer even though I don't have any plans I'm really just gonna be working sadly no European summer for me this summer But I'm just excited to just have nice weather be outside continue my YouTube Consistency because I've been pretty consistent recently and I'm pretty proud of myself I think it's just fun to document your life. I know watching videos like this back. I'm gonna be just so happy that I made them. Okay, water just finished boiling. I actually haven't had coffee today, but I'm just gonna let this one sit for a little bit. I'm gonna have uh, a little bit of snack. These are the olives that I got yesterday. This is good. Thought I was snacking on some olives. Kind of a weird snack, but. I came to the living room. <laughs> I got a plum sour. What did you get? You don't have your baby? Oh, uh, I got a spicy coconut margarita from the truck. And I'm driving. Yes, <laughs> our driver. <laughs> Okay, so we finished at dinner, and now we're at Village Ice Cream, getting the iconic ice cream. And we got the city skylight! Oh my god, that looks so good. That looks good. Okay, excuse this lighting, but we just got back from dinner, and we took some photos. Hopefully, I find a good one in there, and post it on Insta. If if there is a good photo and it's on insta this is the post go like the food was pretty good it's nothing it wasn't anything crazy like it was it was pretty good it's like 10 o'clock right now i'm pretty tired even though honestly it was up pretty early today today's been kind of a long day but i haven't done anything crazy i'm just gonna shower get into bed and probably read honestly It's a leaf. I just did my makeup. I did literally like the lightest makeup ever, but it's really nice out right now. So I think I'm gonna go for a walk before I get some work done for uni, which honestly the work that I'm doing for uni is fun. So I'm excited to do it, but I wanna get outside before so I can at least have some fresh air and enjoy the sun while it's out. So yeah, time to go for a little walk. Hey, Bobby. What are you doing? back from my walk and honestly I always forget how much 10 minutes 
20 minutes, 30 minutes of being outside. It's crazy how much of a difference it can make in your in your mood. So I'm gonna make a little matcha. Uh, I think the dishwasher is done. I'll probably put the dishes away. And then I'm gonna get into my drawing for school. But I've been really loving drawing. I haven't drawn this much since I was probably in grade seven. And I remember enjoying it so much. And just getting back to the things you love as a kid is so, I don't know, refreshing. Just makes you feel, I don't know, we used to do so many cool things as kids, just ran things, and we were so creative in our imagination, so it's just nice to go back to things like that. cat mugs that we have you would think we literally own 10 cats we really have two almost every single one of those mugs has to do with cats i'm gonna make a strawberry matcha i'm gonna add in a little bit we have like the perfect amount of milk for this if even that we might have not enough oh okay that's perfect perfect i was scared for a second and then oh beautiful okay of course i get my drawing board out and Bob just goes. And I bet she's about to lie down. Can we guess how long it'll take? Five seconds. Anyways, I did my matcha. That is pretty good. I'm just taking a break during my drawing. I was at Walmart yesterday and I found these hummus dips. I've never seen them before. I got two of them. They were two for six. First one's the cauliflower. And then the other one is sriracha carrot. So I'm gonna have that dip them. Dip them with some Tostitos. like a grandma right now and my little floral PJ set. But it has recently occurred to me that I have not journaled in a while. And that's partially because I've officially finished another journal and then this is a brand new moleskin journal. If you know, you know. I was thinking I might write in this a bit because I find when I don't journal, like my brain just gets all jumbled up. I don't know. If you haven't tried journaling before, just try. Just write literally whatever comes to your brain, anything that you're thinking of that you just wanna get rid of the thought. Or if you just wanna write for memories, nostalgia, just write, write whatever comes to mind. But yeah, I'm gonna write in this a little bit and maybe read after. Mm -hmm. 